All right, George. Speaking of George, George Hamilton here on my left, Jack Jones on my right. You mentioned something about uh, you have something in common. Yes, we do. We both have the same writer. Uh, the, he wrote each song that we recorded. Record. Uh, yours is wise. I think I could word that better. Oh, you would try it again, but I, you know, George, a lot of people were surprised when you, uh, you entered the uh, the recording artist field. What inspired this? I was I was surprised too. It was something new for me. But uh, my father was an orchestra leader years ago, and music was uh, kind of natural to me. And I think nowadays, you know how it is. You've got to enter the back door to get into the front. I think uh, I started in acting first, and then I always wanted to sing, and so I had to first get kind of planted in pictures. Well, does this facet of your career have anything to do with the, the fact that it's rumored you might play the part of a musical hero type? Well, I'm going to do, uh, I think, Hank Williams' uh, life, the story of Hank Williams, and uh, as you know, what a wonderful country artist he was. So I went down to Nashville the other day and spent about... Uh, Spent a month there the other night. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you get letters from the Nashville Chamber. Now, wait a minute. i got to fight you on that because I'm going to be in Nashville in a couple of days, and this is the most fabulous town in the well, world. That's what I mean. It's 16th Street. I'm down, I was down there with Farron Young and uh, all of the Claude Gray and everybody down there, and I loved it. But uh, I think what I meant by a month was that we were up night and day, you know, because I couldn't stop. I sat in a hoot nanny. That's what they told me it was. And uh, they played every song that I've heard uh, country and then all the new ones that uh, were coming out. I loved it.